Hey guys, Pulpa here, the Sniper with the Skills, and welcome back to Grand Theft Auto Online. Since our last video, I have been grinding like crazy. And I've unlocked a lot of new stuff, you guys. First off, if you check out my money, we are at 124 grand. I've been working my butt off, and if you check out my name on the player list, I am officially on Neebs Gaming's GTA crew, which is pretty awesome. So, also I've decided until things go horribly wrong, I'll be playing in non-passive mode. So if we get killed, we get killed. But the reason I'm not in passive mode is because I want to show you guys what we've unlocked. Boom! Marksman rifle, mini SM, micro SMG, pistol, pistol, 50 milligrams. Vintage pistol, flare gun, grenades, proximity mines, tear gas, sawed off shotgun, knife, nightstick, hammer, bottle, anti cavalry dagger, and yeah, I've been very busy. And also, you guys, I've managed to unlock some other stuff. So now Simeon spams me all the time to buy, to steal cars for him. And also, I've been able, I've unlocked a new area, and I'm able to call Gerald now for missions. So I can start my own, I can host missions, and I've been doing pretty good. Which is proven by me being level 15. Alright, so... Let's hop in our car, and we have to go visit someone. Because, you see, I got this strange anonymous phone call from this guy named Lester, and he said to go visit his house. So, let's do that. Let's bring up the map, and let's mark it off, and I'll see you guys once we get there. Oh, before I go, I almost forgot. I unlocked something. I also purchased something. <laughs> When I found out it was in the game, I couldn't resist. So I'll do my best not to spam it. But you have to hold it down, so I actually had to switch it from my E key to my Razor Naga so I could easily activate it. <clears throat> Alright, so I think we're here. I think we're here. It, I think this is the house. It, is this the house? I think it is. I was wondering when you'd show up. Okay, I'm scared. Wait, I think I've seen this guy before. Welcome to paradise. <laughs> if your idea of paradise is a place where a sick, creepy voyeur can spy on anyone in the country with total impunity. <laughs> Actually, I guess that kind of is the American dream, huh? Hmm. Anyhow, uh, I digress. You have made a big name for yourself. And that name is Dangerous Idiot who's just waiting to get robbed. Thank you. Do yourself a favor and put some of that... Uh, not so hard earned money into real estate, and you can be a real player, just like me. <laughs> oh, Jesus, as I say that, I realize how depressing and pathetic I've become. I'm a, a mess, you know. Uh, take pity on me. Don't mind me sitting on this and, ow, desk. Kill me. Ah. <laughs> and I thought it was funny. Do you play Five hey? Nights at Freddy's? Well, like I said, put some of that money into property. Okay. Sorry people want to rob you soon enough. There will be people who want to kill you. And if anybody gets particularly fresh, just give me a shout. I can put a bounty on them, and every whack job in the state will want to get them off your back for you. Of course, you never know. Maybe someone asked me to do it to you. Oh, no. no. Oh, that was awkward. You think? Oh. Okay, so Lester is a source of bounties. 
I want someone dead, Lester can place a bounty on them. Can I go back in the house and say hi again? Or am I gonna get in trouble? Oh, wait, can I just walk in? Nope, okay. So, I really need to get an apartment, you guys. Like he said, I think apartments unlock being able to make heists. But the problem is, I want to wait for one of the best apartments. Wait, what? Lester can make the cops ignore me? Oh, that sounds awesome. So I guess Lester can give temporary immunity. Uh, earlier on, he was messaging me about like, hey, cause some distraction so the cops don't pay attention where, where I need people to do stuff that the cops need to pay attention to. So I'm guessing he can return the favor and do it to up, do it for me as well. Well, anyways, guys, part of this video for GTA, if I'm able to, I'd like to show you how I'm able to main, how I'm able to take out an, an entire mission for Gerald. I might be able to do it all on my own, actually. I'm not sure yet. Who's this? What up, wussy? I saw you racing. Not bad, but it's time to move out of the blue chips into something more volatile. Up the risk, up the gain, you feel me? I'm talking parachuting! San Andreas is full of totally rad jump spots, so crank it up a notch! Dominator out! <laughs> Who was this man? Hi, I mean, we're looking at Tuesday, right? Who was that? I'm, I'm scared. People get my number. I didn't sign up for any credit cards or go on a vacation. How do people know my phone number? I am still not the best driver. Ah! Not the best driver just yet. Let's disable my phone's sounds while driving. Okay, there we go. Oh, what? Why? Why? Whenever I nick someone and they ha they leave their horn out, I feel like they die in the car. I don't know why. Oh no. Oh, there are a lot of people. Alright. Counter sniper to the rescue. Alright, let's grab some tear gas. in there still please don't tell me they just dropped it where is it please let enemies show okay Let's go! Boy, my car's back there. And so the point of these missions are after you're done, you have to go over to Gerald's house and drop off the drugs. Oh wait, which house are we going to?
And here we go. Mission accomplished. And for you guys that don't know from the last video, that's Gerald. I think he's immortal because I've given him a lot of drugs uh -huh. and he has not died yet. Great. Seriously, like, he has like at least several metric tons worth of drugs in his house now from me grinding and trying to get enough to get the grenades unlocked. Alright, let's see if we can keep this going, see if they're all up for another round. This one's fun because I get to snipe. they don't take my car. Nope, nope. Nope, I'm out. Take the car. I'll be over here sniping. Alright. What? Okay, okay, I'll go. Okay, we gotta get out of here. Because we're about to get ambushed. I wonder if I hit them. There are a lot of enemies. And everyone is afraid of a flare gun apparently. I also found that out you guys. Ooh, level 16, nice. Go! I'm planting bombs! Bombs are planted. Here comes the ambush. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. Guys, wait a second. There's gonna be an ambush car. Wait, no, no, there's explosives. And that is why I planted explosives. I did not know if that was going to blow up our, our teammates' cars or not. Sorry, car. Next time. Oh 
Oh my gosh. We did it. What you got? We did it though. That one I en I enjoy because I always plant the explosive. There we go. Nice. Now keep your mouth shut about me. Here. Okay, Mr. Magic Man who can't die from overdosing on drugs. Bomb has been planted. Let me get at least one kill, you guys. Here comes the explosion! Ah! Three, two, one. Enemies down. Let's go pick up some free money. I can't believe that works. Where's the money? Of course, underneath a burning vehicle. There we go, level 17. Who's this? Hello, this is a courtesy call from Trevor Phillips Industries to tell you that you've messed up very badly. My boss is very angry, and you really would not like him when he's angry. He insists you come to our HQ in Sandy Shores and explain yourself. He told me to tell you to bring knee pads and mouthwash not sure what that means, but I would hurry if I were you. Which, right now, I'm glad I'm not. So guys, I'm going to call this episode here. Thank you all for watching. If you're enjoying Grand Theft Auto, be sure to leave a like and comment down below with what you want to see on my chat with this game. One thing I'm definitely going to do off camera is I'm going to grind until I can afford... It's a little rude screaming in my video. But guys, my goal is this building right here. So yeah guys. Thank you all for watching. My name is Paul Brunscore TF2 the Sniper with Skills, and I will see you later, my fellow mercs. Goodbye. I'm scared. Hey, this is that person. Yeah, I know who this is, Ron. I know who this is. Come here. Hold me. Come on. What? Hold me like you love me. What? Oh, ow. Oh. Hey, uh, uh, you know why I'm a cupcake? Huh? It's not because I want to.
It's because you have been me. And bang, 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 huh? Ah! Now normally, I have that whole beggars can't be choosers, take anything you can when it comes to love attitude. But when the love takes the form of someone on my business, I'm not interested. What's your problem, huh? Why aren't you scared of me? I am scared. You come here. After all the trouble you've caused, I want you to get out there right now and start taking care of all those businesses you've over, especially mine. Now get going, get to work. 